Marlene Hutchinson, and welcome to Tips for Guitar Playing Success. As many of you know, I've been sharing my guitar playing tips every Thursday for more than eight years. It's been my way to hopefully help you stay motivated, be inspired, and continue expanding your guitar playing journey. If you're interested in more learning resources like my Thursday Tips blog, my DVDs, books, virtual learning, and more, go to my website, marlenesmusic.com. And for anyone who's listening and feels like you're missing out on all the fun, you can easily join our wonderful world of guitar with my Learn to Play Guitar in a Day program, which you can also find at marlenesmusic.com. Now on to today's tip. Today's tip is the top seven funniest reasons not to practice. In my nearly 20 years of teaching guitar, I've heard them all, the excuses or reasons a person was not able to practice. Some have been funny some creative, and some, I have to admit, were a bit on the weak side. Whether you're new to guitar playing or an experienced player, you have probably figured out that your guitar playing success is directly and completely related to how much you're able to practice. Practice for some people seems a little bit like a dirty word. It may seemingly represent perceived punishments or torture, but practicing should be fun and something you look forward to, and I'll talk more about that in a little bit. But first, here are the seven funniest reasons not to practice. Number one, my dog, of course you could fill in any animal here, my dog, my cat, my hamster, ate my music. Number two, Because I had to go to school or work. Three, I couldn't remember what to practice. Four, we got a new dog or any kind of pet or computer or TV this week. Number five, my strings broke. Hey everyone, just a quick reminder to join my podcast club at the Join the Club link in the show notes or on my website, marlenesmusic.com. You'll receive cool benefits like previews, admission to my monthly club events, and more. Again, you can join at marlenesmusic.com. Dot com, or in the show notes, look for the Join the Club link and welcome to the club. Now on to number six. I was out of tune. And number seven, one of my favorites, I couldn't find my guitar. In all seriousness, though, practicing is the key. And what I would hope for you is that you'll want to practice. To give you a little assist on that, check out some of my practice ideas, like Maximizing Your Practice Time episode on January 7th, 2021, and How to Set a Practice Routine episode on April 9th, 2020. But here's the deal. For anyone who would like to be a better guitarist, then it really comes down to finding reasons to practice, inspirations that get you excited about playing guitar. So what are some reasons to practice? Here's a few that I came up with. I want to learn a new song. I want to learn a new skill. I want to get better at playing a certain song. I want to get better at playing certain skills like string slapping, which I talked about last week or finger picking, or tablature, or bar chords. I want to learn something, a song or a skill, for Christmas, or Fourth of July, or someone's birthday. I would like to perform at an open mic night or coffee house. The list is long and endless for me. How about for you? What are some of your reasons to practice? In fact, maybe get a piece of paper and a pen out right now and write down the reasons that you want to practice guitar. 
because that is how you'll totally and completely have fun while improving your guitar playing. No excuses to come up with or fret about. Just play guitar. I hope this episode's tip has helped you to continue expanding your guitar skills and knowledge. If you'd like to learn more, check out the many learning resources available at my website, marlenesmusic.com. Thank you for joining today's podcast. And as I like to say, play on.